La Vega, Venezuela. One of Caracas' dangerous slums. Why is it dangerous? Is it because of gang violence? It could be. And maybe there are other reasons. I will tell you the main reason in two words. Bad leadership. Average inflation last year reached a surreal 80,000%. Almost no one in La Vega or anywhere in Venezuela can survive on what they make from work. The economy is so broken that an average teacher's salary is around $6 a month, which will only buy you a few dozen eggs. Almost half the population of Venezuela would go hungry to bed without charity or food handouts. What is going to happen now here in Venezuela? We're going to go to Slum. Have you been there before? First time going to Slum. Let's do it, man. I'm excited. I visited these kitchen communities in La Vega with Venezuelan volunteers feeding kids who otherwise wouldn't get any food. Venezuela is an example of people standing together in the time of a humanitarian crisis, even with their own politicians letting them down. These ladies you see in here, they are the real heroes. And it touched me so deeply to see people thinking of others, even when having their most difficult moment themselves. Lessons to be learned from the slums of Caracas, Venezuela. I learned some very important things in these slums. This is my son, my son in Venezuela. And, uh, obviously, no giving guarantees in this hood. Anyway, it's some really nice people. The best way to not feel hopeless is to get up and do something. Hola, amigo! Don't wait for good things to happen to you. If you go out and make some good things happen, you will fill the world with hope. You will never find something like this. I wasn't killed in the slums of Venezuela, even though most people would consider La Vega a red zone and a no-go. But to be fair, I understood the biggest purpose of life in La Vega. <laughs> They said, they said that you should come because Venezuela is the best country. <laughs> no one has ever become poor by giving. Te amo La Vega. I will never forget Venezuela. Remember to subscribe to Gus on the Go. 149 countries and more to come. Venezuela! I really love this community here in Caracas, Venezuela. It's so cool that you have people like this who take care of kids in this way. Super cool.